Spyro. Hey, Spyro. Some nine, huh? Beautiful. Huh. Why do I have to want something? I'm just ready to begin the best day ever now that the evil psycho she-dragon is gone. Whoa. Calm down, big fella. Gosh, you're awfully tense. Hmm? Haven't been sleeping much? You should listen to Voltaire tell of his stories. I'll put anyone to sleep. Okay, you ready? I get up to get some fresh air. Since I don't sleep much myself these days with a uh, female fright hanging about. Lo and behold, there she was, sneaking out into a garden. Oh, she gives me the creeps, dude. Here are my teeth. It's dangerous for any of us to be outside at night. Besides, Ignitus said you'd have to wait till your powers return. Because you're weak. Uh, <coughs> you'd be helpless without me. I better <coughs> come with you. What? I can't hear you over all the snoring. That's good enough for me. Let's go. See ya. I do. Speak for yourself. Now can we finally get some sleep around here? I've been only sort of half sleeping with one eye open for weeks now. Alternating eyes, of course. It lessens the strain, but I tell ya, it's taking a toll. Hey, was this Twitch always there? Spyro? You okay, buddy? Hey, I want to sleep too, but I didn't mean now. Let's at least get inside. It's... It's dark out, man. And I don't like it. Hello? Anybody home? Yoo-hoo! Hello? 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 Anyone home? Hello? Hello? No kidding. While you were catatonic, this whole place has been hooting and howling. Listen. Are you crazy? You want to run towards the danger? Ugh. I like you better when you're sleeping. Hey, ugly ape guy. <laughs> now that we've exchanged pleasantries, can we fight? Or at least you two can fight and I'll watch. <laughs>